Yo YouTube and welcome back to the channel. In this video today we're actually going to be looking at Virtual Fighter 5 Ultimate Showdown which is actually a remake, I think it's an old remake of the Xbox 360 and I think it came out PS4. I definitely played it on the Xbox 360. The good news for anyone who owns a PlayStation and also has the PlayStation Plus uh, internet service so you can play online with it, this game is actually free, it came out on Wednesday. So we've had a bit of a hands-on with it over the last few days just to see what it plays like, what we think of it. One great thing I would say about this is uh, a lot of people are calling it a bit of a remaster. I wouldn't call it a remaster. They've actually rebuilt the entire graphics using the Yakuza engine, what Zeg uses for their games. So the graphics are absolutely fantastic. They've all been remodeled, all been redone. It's not just an old game what's been done in a higher resolution uh, and then the 60 frames per second frame rate stuck on there, what a lot of remasters tend to do. It has been built from the ground up. There is no additional characters or anything like that. It is the original base game. Although there is a DLC pack what is available at launch, I believe, which does give you some of the character models from the old uh, Virtual Fighter games, which were obviously like the blocky characters, especially from Virtual Fighter 1. Virtual Fighter 2 I did play a lot of back in the day. It was probably one of my favourite fighting games. I must admit, I've never been great at Virtual Fighter. I was never a massive fan of just the punch, kick, punch, guard type combo button system. Uh, this one I've had a lot of fun with. So far I've only given the arcade mode a blast, just seeing how the characters play, how the game feels. And from a hands-on approach, it runs fantastic. Uh, the frame rate is great, obviously running at uh, 60 frames per second. The resolution on the characters look fantastic. Uh, for me, how a fighting game looks always grips me as well as how good the mechanics are. Uh, maybe it's because I've got a little bit older now and I'm starting to sort of understand the different style of the, uh, the, the mechanics of how these games sort of work. But it is a game I really want to invest a bit more time into uh, and, and get good at. Now, one thing I would say is I haven't had a chance to have a go at yet is the online. Now, I do know that this runs on delay-based netcode. Uh, most fighters today, as, as all those fighting gurus really want to hear, is that it would run on rollback netcode, which is a lot better. At the moment, delay-based netcode is not a bad thing because for the first time in a long time, there's probably going to be more people than ever playing a virtual fight again with this being free on the PlayStation. So the chances that you get a match mate next to somebody or very close to you are very high at the moment. As the game starts to filter out over time, uh, the delay based netcode is not going to be great because you're going to end up probably fighting people a lot further across the globe, a lot further away. So that's where you're going to probably encounter a few issues, which is what obviously makes rollback netcode so great. However, I will say I have had a lot of fun with the game and for a free game, I think this is absolutely fantastic. If anyone is wanting to try out a really good fighter and you've got a PlayStation, you've got the PlayStation Plus, definitely download this game. Sega have put a lot of work into this remaking it. As I say, it's not just a remake. They have completely revamped it. Again, the gameplay is great. It looks great. And as I've said already, anyone looking for a great fighter, for a free one, you can't go much wrong with Virtual Fight 5 Ultimate Showdown. The game came free as from Wednesday this week, the 1st of June. So grab it while you can. It's a great addition to the free games, what PlayStation put out every month. As I say, I haven't had too much chance to play the online yet, but we'll be getting to groups with that over the weekend after a little bit more practice so we don't get his ass kicked too much. And for more Virtual Fire Ultimate Showdown, guys, you know where to come. Hit the subscribe, hit the notification so you get notified when all those videos go live. And once again, stay safe. Peace out. Wow.
Cold.